Welcome to a new edition of Economy for Everyone on its digital version, a summary of the economical and financial information of Panama and the world. Let's begin. To finance the construction of the new South Terminal of the Tokimen International Airport and to respond to the growing demand that is generating in recent years, among other needs, Tokimen SA and the bank rival SA have placed bonds for the amount of $400 million in the stock exchange of Panama. The bonds with maturity of 10 years and coupon of 5.75% payable quarterly corresponds to a first tranche of an authoritative value of $650 million. The South Terminal has an advance of 20% now with an investment around $679 million. The Minister of Economy and Finance, Frank de Lima, was part of the second plenary of macroeconomic challenges developed during the seventh competitiveness firm of the Americas. During his presentation, he explained that there are factors that has allowed the country outlining positively within the region. El modelo de económico panameño debe ser el modelo emulado por los otros países de la región. Nosotros lo que hemos hecho es que el Estado está haciendo la inversión pública para generar crecimiento, generar empleo y que también permita que la empresa privada se monte sobre esa infraestructura que se está haciendo el gobierno nacional y pueda desarrollar eh, sus proyectos a futuro también. Under the motor converting Panama into the innovation hub of the Americas, the Panamanian Chamber of Information and Telecommunication Technologies, Capatec, and the City of Knowledge Foundation conducted the fifth meeting of business and innovation, VESFET Panama 2013. In this meeting, most relevant experts and leaders of the public and private sector, academic entrepreneurs and researchers sectors participated in the country. The Ministry of Economy and Finance during the last four years has made the Encendido de Luces that symbolizes the light of hope in the ongoing struggle against cancer and this year's was not the exception. In this activity, the First Lady of the Republic was present and expressed the importance of this campaign, which has a team for this year, celebrate the life, do the test on time. It is important that all the citizens have conscience of our body, of that it is a disease that is totally preventable, that if it is detected at the time, it has hasta 90% of it to be cured. So, for all, once a year, it has to be done in October, to do those exams. With this information, we conclude Economy for Everyone on its digital version. Remember to listen to us on Radio Con every Thursday from 3 to 4 p.m. and watch us on SORT TV on Tuesdays at 1 p.m. every two weeks and follow us on our social networks. Thank you for watching. See you next week.